So I didn't think I was going to do another video, but I kind of got hooked on the uh, Jesse Smollett debacle going on. I mean, I've been watching it for a while, but I didn't think I had anything to say on it. Until I heard an uh, interview with Pierce Morgan and then someone else. Um, oh, it was, I think it was the BET uh, gala. The Black Women's uh, Gala. Um, and the, the concept of wanting attention, playing the victim, or becoming known as a victim and having an outpouring of people supporting you. Um, you know, that's, that's covert narcissism right there. You know what I mean? Or vulnerable narcissism or vigilant narcissism and I, I feel for that and I I know with gays it's narcissism is kind of huge with gym culture and the you know the the pressure to look a certain way and not everyone can do that so then you have to kind of uh, get attention another way um, and you know, although things have changed for gays, it's still, uh, I mean, if you look at Empire at the beginning, I mean, it was the way they portrayed it, like in the in Empire and uh, the haves and the have-nots. I don't have a TV here, but when I was uh, uh, in the States, I would see the shows, so I saw them from the, saw, you know, the, 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 the concept of uh, the pressure to, to, to come out as gay and the treatment and um, the, the pressure of the culture itself um, with, you know, with attention and body beautiful and um, the criticism and clicks it's like going out in high school again, you know what I mean? Um, even with bears, you know, where they're initially known as, you know, just fat and hairy, it was a click, you know what I mean? Now it's become more inclusive with apps like Growler, uh, different types of bears, you know what I mean? But, so, I mean... I know of in the 90s, you know, it was a, it was a thing that people would uh, purposely com get themselves infected with HIV so they could sell their insurance policies and become part of a group, you know, uh, for that they want attention from their peers or from people they want people to love them, you know, or like them, or uh, adore them, or give them attention. And so, it's evolved, but it's still that culture. And of course, it's more and more mainstream now, the, the need for attention. And everyone who's online, we're all, we've all got narcissism in us. Um... That's all I want. All I wanted to kind of say on it. It's just kind of it's a it's a reflection of everyone. I mean, he was able to get that attention through, uh, you know, the way he did it. Other people will show their ass on Instagram. They'll do it the best way they can to get uh, reactions and likes and you know. Uh, it's tough. I don't have anything to say upon it. I'm just noticing it uh, where where it kind of connects with your image of self-worth and um, even myself if relying on other people to dictate my mood is not a good thing. What to validate me is 
is, is really not a good thing. So, recognition of that is important. So, that's it. I'm going to upload this quickly. I have part two of my uh, other video. I'm feeling better now. I managed to get out of my, my slump, so... Um, I'm going to upload this first, but the part two of the video uh, will be tomorrow. So I'm going to upload this tonight and publish it.